guys, it is me, KZ, and today we are going to be doing something very exciting. So today we are going to be introducing you guys to the Warrior Cat series. Now, no noise background, just loud noise. But um, today, yes, it is finally here. We are introducing you into the Warrior Cat series. So if you do not know what Warrior Cats is, listen up, because if you're interested in reading books, if you love books, then this is the series for you, and you love books, you love cats, you love animals, this is the book series for you. So, first off, I'm going to say, War Cats is amazing. Second off, I'm going to say, this is some of my collection. So I'm going to show you some of my collection of the book series. So as you guys probably have heard, um, I love drawing and stuff. So, you're going to see some of the drawings that I've done and stuff. But... This is out of the Warrior Cat thing. I just found this in there. So this is something I've made a long time ago. This has nothing to do with the Warrior Cats, but I just thought I'd show it to you guys because, you know, it's an album. It's cute. But that's something I painted. I'm so happy of it. But that's besides the point. Today we're on Warrior Cats. So basically, if you haven't been introduced to the series, um, I'm going to need you to tell, tell you guys a little bit about it. So, yeah. Basically, it's best book series ever. And I've been making things for ages about Warrior Cats now because Warrior Cats is an amazing series about cats. So this is, but this is, this isn't just Warrior Cats. This is my fandom of Warrior Cats. So something me and my friends made up a long time ago. Well, not a long time ago. It just seems like forever because it's been like two or three years that most I've been reading Warrior Cats for now. It's been a long time in consideration to me. So we've made up. So forget the book series. I'm just kidding. No, don't forget it. It's amazing. I love it. Read it. But we have differed from again. We have broken the rules of Warrior Cats. No, not war, war, rules of Warrior Cats. It's rules of books in general. We have me and my group of friends. Now we've made instead of doing like a like just following the book series, we have straight from the book series. We have I don't know. And something sounds weird, but like we have. Like, we've made ourselves, like, we've gotten rid of cats that we don't want in our own made-up series thing. We've added cats, our own OC characters. OC is, means own character. Um, we've made up our own characters. We have made up our um, side characters, SC, side characters. Um, so, like, they're, they're our characters that we made up, but they're not actually us. Um, so, first... So yeah, we've basically a story. So we've made cats alive. We've brought cats back from the dead. We've changed ages of cats. We've made changed everything. So yeah, basically, I'm going to be introducing you to the world of warrior cats. Let's begin. Oh. So, um, our world in warrior cats. I am a she cat. I am a Turkish fan cat. My name is Rose Fur. I am a white she cat with ginger slash red stripes. Um, and I have an odd ginger rose shape on my back. I have ginger paws, ginger tail tip, and a ginger tuft for my um one eye. Um, my name is Rose Silver, later to become Rose Star, leader of Thunder Clan. Um. But in this picture, it is Rose Star. Now, as you know, I love drawing pictures of phantoms and stuff. It's weird. It's my weird. For I'm one of the people that you get on Warrior Cats, you love it, and then you make this whole. You just you could I could talk for hours to you guys about Warrior Cats. I could rant on and on and on about Warrior Cats. But yeah, this is what I look like. That is what I look like. I am Rose Star right now. But right now I'm Rose Fur. Later on, I come Rose Star. That is what I look like. I am a white she cat with the uh, yep the ginger flame um paws and the rose shape on my back, which is f henceforth rose, rose fur, rose star, and the eyes. Of, this is um another style of me drawing cats. It's one of my newer styles. My old styles are different, completely different. Like I'll show you what some of my older ones. Now, as you know, I have my one of my best friends in real life. Um, her YouTube is Mega. She is Mega Kitten Two Three Four. She has actually made a YouTube account now, so go subscribe to her. She's amazing. 
She's my best friend in real life. And so this is a picture of me and her. This is an old picture. That's one of my first pictures I've ever drawn. So but this notebook was actually given to me by her. So thank you. Thank you very much, Mega Kitten. Um, but that's, that's an old style of me drawing. And that's what um, Mega looks like um, in this. So that's what Mega Kitten looks like in this. But yeah. That's an really old style of drawing for me. But then, as you can see over time, it changed a little bit. Not much. Then I still do draw cats like that, but it's changed a lot. Like that's a sitting position of a cat. That is my friend. Um, forgot what we called him in one of the videos. And then, so yeah, I've changed. It's changed a lot. Like I draw cats in the book series. That's cat named Bramaclaw, Squirrel Paw, um, Dinner Pram, Squirrel Flight, Crow Paw, Feather Tail, Stormclaw. That's the that's the that's the fur. Storm fur. Feathers, tails, storm fur. Yes. Okay, I'm just forgetting because there's a cat named Storm Storm fur and Stone fur. Now they're completely different cats. But that's Storm fur and Feather tail, Feather turn, Storm fur, a brother and sister. Then that's a cat named Cropa. And that's Bramaclaw. This little I don't know why I just do a little turtle on his tail. Then Squirrel flight, which is later, which is Squirrel part right now. And then that's Tawny pelt, Bramaclaw's sister. And that's another old style of me drawing, but. This is how oh, this might look familiar to you guys, might not. Haha, <laughs> my adventure series skin, aka something used for anything skin. Um, that is actually before I drew it, I based it off of that. And then I let you guys, it's like, okay, where does M4 come in this? Now, she's not really a big into Warrior Cats, like she hasn't really read the books or anything, but we're trying, we're trying still. But she, her, um, and her cat, her cat's name is Misty Frost. So that is what she looks like. She is Misty Frost. She is a white, grayish blue she cat with um, whitish gray snowflake, um, snowflake shapes in her fur. Her name is Misty Frost. That is M Force Cat. And yeah, so basically, for I keep, keep ranting on, um, that is kind of the pe my and people I know around me, um, cats. And then like. I could list you hundreds of cats' names in the book series and made up from us, by us, but this is my small collection. This is my one of my kittens. His name is Lion Fur. Um, actually, I, this is made out of a, um, yeah, cheddar cheese. Cheddar cheese cracker, aka off-brand of Ritz. And so this is, that's, I painted that. That is a picture of my kitten. His name is Lion Fur. He's a adorable kitten. But yes. So <laughs> <laughs> Camera. <laughs> okay. Before I start laughing my head off, I am so sorry, guys. I did not mean to bump you. I am so sorry. That was so uncalled for and weird. So cringeworthy. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry for that. Dramaticness of that all. Try and keep the camera from tipping over now. Guys, wait a minute. That's the picture that I showed you earlier. Okay. Here we go. Ah! Okay, there we go. Okay, now it's going to be sitting. So, this is my small word cat collection. I have tons more than this, but, um, yeah, they're all over the house. But this is the one's just that I had in my bedroom. I do not have the full series, don't go ranting on. That's not the full series, that's all mixed up. This is not the full series. Our library has a thing where they have a summer reading program and they, you know, that you get prizes for reading every now and if you read so like if you read a if you read I think ours is like fifteen minutes a day. Um no 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 fifteen the if you read an hour a day you get um, one prize slip then, and two prize slips I do believe gets you a book. So that's how I got most of my Warrior Cat books. That, and one of the, one of them, this one right here is from uh, from from the other. Yeah, my mom got for me, but this is basically my Warrior Cat series, my short series right now. So I have Warrior Cats: The New Prophecy, the second series, um, book six so of the second series, Sunset. The last book of the second series. 
Oh, it's Firestar. Yeah, what that little gem is, I just put that there for some reason. I don't know. And there's um, book five of the second series, Twilight. Bring it backwards. And then, I think I have book one and two of that series, and maybe. I don't, I don't think I have any more from there this season. So, yeah. And the new pro um, element of the stars, one of um, the last of the series. So, these are kind of... The first, these are the first books of every series, the first series, the second series, the third series, and the fourth series. This is the fourth series. I think they're making a series five, or they already have. I'm not sure. I don't think they have yet, though. It's not in libraries or anything, but this is, that's Dovewing. This is Almond of the Stars, The Fourth Apprentice, book one. Then there's Barking in the Background, which is not needed and unnecessary for my dog, which I'll show you in another episode, but... One well, not another app, but they'll just another different video. And this is Fading Echoes, Omen of the Stars number two. And we got Omen of the Stars number four. Yep, we skipped three, Sun of the Moon. And then we got this one from Rummage Sale, New Prophecies, book two, New Prophecies, Moonrise. Then we got some of the comics. Now, if you're like, like me, when I, because when I started reading more cats, I just read the comics because the books were too long, but there's a... The books are not that long, but to some people they're really long. So if they don't, though, they have very short um, fandoms. Except they're comic. They're like mangas, like manga comics. So yeah, and I think you can get them in. I don't know. I think you get them at your local library, or you can buy them off of pretty much anywhere. And so yeah, I have the first, the second one of Raven Paul's Path, and the third one of Raven Paul's Path. I couldn't get the first, the first one though. So yeah, we just scroll the books, and that's my short book series. I have a few floating around the house that I don't know where they went. So yeah, basically that's kind of my introduction of about a few things about Warrior Cats, a few things about um, me and Warrior Cats, and yeah. So thank you all so much for watching. This is Casey Patsy signing out. See you later, guys. Bye.